Wow, so this is the world, huh? It's beautiful, such majestic animals. Oh wow, seahorses. Oh, hey there, little buddy. Yeah, I'm beating you with your own brother. Let that be a lesson. What the hell are you looking at? No, I'm literally not sure what you're looking at. Huh. I may want to keep some of these animals around in case I have to, uh, repopulate the Earth. Why aren't I mining down? You gotta use tools, idiot. So, like, in the side of the cliffs? Dude, I don't know. I'm a f***ing chicken. You, land pig, take me up that mountain. What? No! Get the hell off of me! Ooh, a carrot! I'm building things! I'm building things! I'm building things! And it's done. Wait, just need to add my birch door. That's a fine birch door you've got there, Staniel. I'm gonna be honest with you. Your house is ugly as f Well, you just haven't seen the inside yet. It's pretty dark in here. Good. It makes it harder to see the ugliness. Why don't you light a torch so you can see better? Hmm. I don't know. I wouldn't want to risk setting fire to all my stuff. There we go! Now we can see that gorgeous birch door! It's the nicest thing I own! And if I put this chest next to my other chest... Dun dun dun! Mega chest! <sighs> oh man, all that animal murder has really made me sleepy. Time to craft a bed. Uh, you need three wool to make a bed. You've only got two. What? He means you gotta go out and kill one more sheep or you can't sleep. Damn it! even after they're dead, they're still pissing me off. What the? Who the hell could that be? I hope it's death. No, really, I'm ready to go. It's a zombie! My birch door! Uh-oh, guys, this is the end. We've known each other for like five minutes. Phew, thank you. Oops, I meant to shoot you guys. Hold still, please. Well, we live here now. All right, it's probably safe out there now. I've got an idea! Hey, Bony Boy! Come check out this beautiful morning sun! Oh, well, I do love a good sunrise. Yeah! All right, we took care of that skeleton and that evil zombie. Looks like that evil zombie was just trying to feed his son. <laughs> oh. And I've got this nice chest to put my rotten flesh into. <laughs> Did you see that stupid sheep's stupid face when I pushed him off the stupid cliff? Then I pushed his brother into that lava? <laughs> we didn't even have to cook tonight! Finally, time to catch up on rest. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Seriously, Stan, this house is much better than your old one. Can't beat waterfront property. Yeah, but my neighbor's a total witch. Karen is a fine lady, okay? She's crazy. I'm pretty sure she cast a spell on Porkchop. Dude, for the last time, she didn't cast- The spirit of Herobrine will consume your soul in an all-encompassing void of darkness. Well, look, a wolf. Anybody still got that bone from that skeleton? Bone me, big face. Hey, psst, buddy. Ooh, another one. Good morning, sir. Might I interest you in a trade? Hmm, I don't really have that much stuff. Well, you can have my pig, you can turn him into bacon. Hey! Hmm, that's a fine pig you've got. I'll give you one sea pickle. What the hell's a sea pickle? This better not be a penis joke. Wait, I packed some sandstone on my llama. Perhaps that will interest you? I'll take the sexy llama. Sir, this llama has a family. The family is also very sexy. What the hell is your problem? You adopted two dogs, and now a llama? This isn't We Bought a Zoo starring Matt Damon. It's fine. I'm gonna build a boat and explore some new land. We'll have a nice big farm for everyone to live on. Um, the wolves are attacking the llama. And they just playing. Chick, you hold down the fort while I'm gone. What? No, dude. I'm out of here. There. Now you can't leave. What? How? Damn it, you're right! Hey, look, it's a squid. I'll call you Squiddy. My name's Brian. See ya, Squiddy! All right, there's a lot of islands we could live on. We just gotta find one that works for the llama and both of the dogs. Uh, looks like there's three dogs now. What? When did that happen? I don't know. I turned my head for two seconds and then boom, baby dog. Strange. Well, let's keep an eye on them. What the hell? Stop it, you guys, jeez. Wow, a sunken ship. You should swim down there and see if there's any chests. What'd you get? Paper. 
blank sheets of paper. What? That's it? And this emerald. Now I can buy the sea pickle from that wandering trader and shove it up his big fat nose. Hey, you! Get out of my waters before I stab you with my trident! <laughs> hey, check it out! It's a merman! What? No! I'm not a merman! I'm a drowned! I'm like a water zombie! Aha! Uh -huh. It's my trident now! Ha! <laughs> Good luck mastering the skill of tridenting! I've been lurking the ocean for years, crafting the art! All right, let's head back home and put all this blank paper in Mega Chest. About time you're back. You didn't show me how to use the furnace. I've been eating rotten baby zombie flesh. Oh, what the hell? More dogs? Yes, sir. Puppies. Why are their heads so big? They'll grow into them. And I got you a special gift for being good and holding down the fort. It's a shell with the freshest, cleanest ocean water you've ever drank. Oh, thanks. I got you, you idiot. You just drank a whole bunch of llama spit. <laughs> Wake up, Stan. It's another beautiful day in the biome. I think. You should get some windows. Uh, you know, every day I wake up and think about eating you. Porkchop is right. There's a whole square world out there. And in this small crappy house, we don't really see any of it. Wait, the world is square? You're saying the earth is flat? Well, sure. The top of it. Hey, you know what? I have an idea. Since we're cramped inside this house, why don't we mine into the side of the cliffs and just make it a huge baller cave house? Woohoo! Cave house! No, house cave. I don't know which name I like better, but let's do it! All right, this place is gonna be a mansion. Oh, oh my god, spider! Relax, dude. They're more afraid of you than you are of them. Hey, I ain't afraid of you, bitch. Cause we digging for diamonds inside a cave house My best friends are a chicken and a pig We got a big ass house You know we gonna dig Until the house is full of diamonds And it's really big We are a team and we stay together Even though the chicken's kind of rude And I never turn them to food but we Wow, we really dug way down into those mines. We even found diamond. You know, I bet we could use that diamond to make an enchantment table. It would really go to good use. Or, and hear me out on this, diamond boots. God damn it. Okay, pork chop. I need you to go down that shaft and set up a whole new furnace and chest down there. That way we don't have to keep walking all the way back up. Uh, okay, uh, I got this. Damn it, Staniel! These are dangerous working conditions! In fact, I think I see an Enderman down there! You're fine, just don't make eye contact. <laughs> Why won't anybody talk to me? <laughs> nope, I am done with this! Have fun with your stupid diamond boots! These boots are not stupid, okay? You're stupid. My house is awesome, it's huge. I could literally fall off a cliff inside my house and die. Weird flex, but okay. Dude! I'm Stan, and I spent weeks digging in a dark hole building a house that nobody ever sees, so I can walk around in it with my stupid diamond boots. You dug this whole mansion to impress who? The duck? I'm a chicken, but okay. I hope a monster breaks in and kills you. If a monster broke in, he could walk around my entire house for six years and not even run into me because it's so big and so cool. Well, you can go f <laughs> Raspberries! I'm just gonna head out too. That's fine. I don't need them. I have a huge house, diamond boots, a creeper buddy. Wait, creeper buddy? Get away! Oh no, oh no! Damn it, he totally ruined my hallway. Well, I'll just chip away at this stone to make it a little wider. Ah! Hey, idiot! Wake up! Ah, uh, what happened? A bunch of dirt blocks fell on you and you started suffocating. Well, that's what happens when you move more bricks than a drug dealer. Get it? That's a metaphor. Okay, calm down, ASAP Blocky. You guys saved my life. I'm so lucky you forgave me and came back. Oh, I didn't forgive you. I just wanted to use the lava jacuzzi. Ah, uh, yeah. Relaxation on a bacon vacation. God, this biome has nothing in it. I swear, this is the same field we've run through over and over again. These are the same hills. In fact, I'm convinced all the pigs in this biome are the same too. 
You, say something! Uh, bees are dying at an alarming rate! See? That's just you! This world is a mess! Porkchop is unique, okay, Stan? Remember when he was cursed by that witch? Yes, I remember. He went on a crazy rampage and murdered all those pillagers at that outpost. Screw you guys! Making up these lies about me, I swear, once I learn how to craft weapons, I'm gonna kill- Ow! Damn it! Hey, check it out! It's a village! Wow! Crops? Houses? Kitties! These houses don't look like garbage like ours does. Greetings! Welcome to our village, friendly travelers. Uh, I'm getting a bad omen from this pig. Perhaps it's the bad omen sign above his head? Hey, mind your own business, Unibrow. Carrots, 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 carrots. Sir, if you'd like, we can arrange a large carrot feast in your honor. Eh, not really much of a carrot guy. Hmm, emeralds, iron leggings. Ooh, potatoes, baby! Pretty good haul! Oh, hi. What you doing there? Oh, uh, nothing. Just admiring the interior design. The yellow bed, great for covering up accidents, am I right? You know, for farmers, you sure have some dead-ass grass. My great-grandfather planted that grass when he founded this land. Let me guess, he's as dead as this grass? You know what? I like the village. I could see myself settling down here. You got a lot of food, cute cats, incoming pillagers. Incoming pillagers? Your cursed omen has spawned a mob of pillagers! Damn you, you cursed swine! Quickly, get inside! <laughs> oh god, we are defenseless! Throw our cuts! <laughs> Don't worry, I've got a bow. <laughs> Whoops. Oh man, I can only move my arms like this! You, idiotic stranger! I have just read from our library that milk will combat this evil curse. Drink up! You heard him. Drink up, boys. Chug, chug, chug! Oh. Screw you, cat, I need this milk! It's working! The omen is fading away! The pillagers aren't spawning! Just one more arrow to the face should do it. We did it! That gross-ass milk saved the day! And I don't think I'm cursed anymore! Did you just say ass milk? I'll never kill another cow again, unless I'm really hungry. Or if he looks at me the wrong way. In honor of saving our village, I'd like to give you all the emeralds in our chest. Just give me one second to go in and grab them. All right, let's get out of here before those idiots realized I robbed them. Great job, Stan. We dug so far down, we don't know which way is up. Will you relax? We're gonna get home safe, okay? Excuse me, Mr. Bad, how the hell do we get out of here? To reach the land in which you've saved, follow the light that leaves the cave. Oh wow, you're a rhyming bat. Can you help us out of here, Mr. Bat? I've got a tamed llama at home I need to get back to. He's not tamed, he's trapped. It's true, I am a bat who rhymes to help us through these trying times. Okay, this dude is annoying. Hey, uh, guys, I think I found a way out. Oof, how are we gonna get around that lava river? Uh, we could build over it like normal non-idiots would. Be gone, lava! Dude, that's the stupidest. What the heck? The water and lava is turning into obsidian. Let's mine it! All right, guys, let's build another portal. Should we, uh, should we go in? We need to remember the Nether is an extremely dangerous underworld. It's an extremely unsafe realm, and not anybody can just enter it. <coughs> well, we're probably ready. Uh, guys, I'm scared. I don't know. Feels like home to me. Look at all these fires! Very dangerous! And this ground block? What's it made of? Mmm, cinnamon. Yo, bro. Welcome to the nether. I'm Blaze. Let me show you around, my dudes. <laughs> Blaze, huh? I can tell why they call you that. You seem like you've been smoking the devil's lettuce. Yeah, he's got a house down here, so it's pretty easy to get. Follow me. Dude, nether wart. I'll use it to make a potion to cure me of this curse. And we already cured you, man. Well, then I'll make other potions. It's science, Daniel. You wouldn't understand. Now to our left, we've got a zombie pig man. He's actually pretty cool, as long as you don't mess with him. Uh, you guys, I'm getting worried. My map's not working. I've got an idea! Let's place stones along our path so we can trace our way back to the portal. The torches will point us in the right direction. 
Whoops, sorry. Watch it, you overworld clouds, or I'll slice your faces off with my crappy, good-for-nothing golden sword. Aw, oh, dude, man. <laughs> they didn't mean any harm. Uh, uh, uh. Dude! You idiots are next! Run! Gast, get them! Well, we're not getting back to the overworld anytime soon. So? How are you guys enjoying the Nelva? Ugh, jeez, it sucks. There's nothing but molten rock. Like, what the hell do you people even eat? Yeah, and this quote-unquote nether fortress is literally just one long, dark hallway. I'm actually really liking it. I've summoned a small army of magma cubes, and they've really taken a liking to me. I'm trying my best, okay? I'd like to turn this place into a decent location for people to live. Well, maybe if there weren't so many evil mobs and so many ways to instantly die, I don't know, people might want to live here. Yes, but what difference can one man, I mean, zombie pig man make? Well, you know, maybe you should run for some sort of position of power, you know, like president. Oh, <sighs> president of the nether. One second. <coughs> Excuse me, I'd like to announce my run for public office. I believe that if we work hard, and if we work together, we can make this a good place to live. So, if there's anything that's on your mind about what change you want to see, please let me know. Uh, the lava. What about the lava? I don't know, there's like, a lot of it. Can you get rid of it or something? You want me to get rid of the lava? And the sky, like, we never see it. Are we underground or... Wait, 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 didn't I kill you? Oh, no, sorry, that must have been a different blaze. Yeah, and there's nothing to eat down here. Soulstone really slows us down. Can we make it so it doesn't do that? Uh, your ideas have been heard, and we're going to work on them. Jeez, they're all kind of right. It does suck down here. Great, so you let us go, right? What? Well, uh, 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 no. I don't know how to get back. Life's not worth living! <laughs> Zombie pig man! Oh. Don't do this, man! Come on! You had to have had some other goal besides being president, right? Well, I always wanted to be a famous singer. Oh my god, of course. Well, come on, man! Show us those pipes! Fly me to the moon! Oh, let me play among the stars. Okay, I think we've heard enough. That was good. That was great. Stan, tell him he's good. Tell him he's good, Stan. That was, uh, you know, you really sang the words. Um... Tell him he was good, Staniel. Uh, I'm terrible. <laughs> Staniel! He's not good at singing! Give me those berries! Stupid human! Ah, gonna fall! More like inventive human, genius human, big stick energy human. Woohoo! Ah! Beans? I don't need no stinking beans! I need nourishment! I have you now. Human ingenuity always prevails. At least I found some diamonds in that death trap. There's gotta be something to eat nearby. Another arrow to the knee and I'll be bone meal. Nether portal! <laughs> what a precious widow angel. Are you lost? Abandoned? <laughs> Looks like we're in the same boat. Then I will name you Bam Bam, and I will hug you, and squeeze you, and pat you forever and ever. Time to save our friends. All right, first I need to mine some stone, find and mine coal and iron, build a furnace, make iron ingots, build a bucket, find water. Mine the obsidian, build the portal, light it up, and then traverse the nether. Easy peasy. Maybe not so easy peasy. Do you happen to know where I might be able to find some food? This project may take a while, and with my energy already depleted, I'm running out of options. 
I can be strong. This is for chicken pork chop. They need me. Goodbye, dear one. Your sacrifice will be much appreciated. Ah. This vicious thing was about to- ah. I can explain, I was starving and- ah. Uh, yeah, this isn't a good look. I'm obsessed with your melons. They're firm, yet sweet and supple. Uh, yeah. You know, with your quest to save your friends, are you sure that it's safe for you to care for a baby panda? Our village would be honored to raise him here, near his ancestral home where other pandas- Yep, I'm sure, thanks. Ah. Bam Bam, if you're going to roll, do it somewhere safe. That should do it. Come on, Bam Bam. Time to rescue our friend. <laughs> <laughs> and then I said to the ghast, now that smells like sulfur. <laughs> oh, uh, hi Stan. Well, congratulations, Stan. Somehow, you've managed to make a house worse than the old one. Would you stop complaining? You should be thankful for the things we have, like, uh, this bone meal. And this spider eye. Ew! Come to think of it, I'm gonna throw all this stuff in here for safekeeping while we go on our next adventure. See that woodland mansion? Ooh, fancy! Well, y'all are in luck because we're gonna go greet our new neighbors. Seeing as our house was built in four minutes and theirs is a luxurious mansion, I think technically we're the new neighbors. Well, we're gonna show them who's boss. We're the tough guys in this fight. Ow! God, who's attacking me? You're standing in pricker bushes, idiot. Stupid cobblestone wall thinks it can stop me from breaking and entering. Ah! Actually, it is pretty protruding. Uh, why do we hang out? The world is infinitely expanding. Wow, this place is huge. Oh boy, a red carpet! Please, please, no flash photography. Sweet, free torches. Wow, really? What, they're free? Oh god, we've got company! I'll lay my life on the line for these stupid, generic, easy-to-make torches. Heads up! He's gonna explode! Oh, well, never mind. Whoa, dudes, check this out! What the heck? A cat statue. It's made of wool. Pretty cozy, actually. Weird. Let's keep exploring. Ooh, a spider room! Yep, f*** no. Ah, oh, dude, a jail cell! Still nicer than our place. Who are they keeping prisoner? Oh, hey guys. Oh, hey, Mr. Zombie. What did you do to end up in here? I did the unthinkable. I mined wood with a pickaxe. <gasps> you sick bastard. Books, plants. Geez, what kind of hippie lives in this room? <laughs> oh my god. Ah. <coughs> oh my god, I'm gonna die. I need fresh air. <laughs> Get out of my way. Stan, pick up that totem. It'll keep you from dying. Still can't breathe. Who would rather just die? <laughs> Whew. Okay, that was close. Hey, how'd that zombie get out of his cell? What? Oh, uh, I definitely didn't let him out. Eat my dirt blocks, losers. I wish you could eat dirt blocks. Then Stan wouldn't have had to murder my entire family. Dude, are you still hung up about that? <laughs> Do you ever wonder if one day he'll snap and turn on us? Staniel grows more powerful by the day. It's only a matter of time before- Woo! Bunnies! Ah, damn it. You could have warned me we were stopping. Oh. My. God! Yeah, they're dirt all right. Just normal floating dirt. Do you know what this means? The mountain was poorly generated. Sky base! Sky base? Aren't those kind of dangerous and time consuming and somewhat pointless? Sky This is, and I say this with complete honesty, the greatest thing I've ever created. Great. Yeah, this is definitely practical. Uh, without the staircase every time you want to get down, what are you going to do exactly? You know what would be really great? A water elevator. Just pour a bucket over the side and use the waterfall to get up and down. That would be a good idea if I would brought my bucket. <sighs> when was the last time you slept? This house has been my passion for, I don't know, three days straight? Three days? We gotta get you inside and get you to bed. Without those jerks on the ground to stop me, I think I can keep building for another day. 
or five. Stanthony, don't you get it? If you don't sleep, bad things can happen. I'll take my chances. I've never looked out upon a valley like this at night without fear, without the presence of doom or some sense of impending destruction. Instead, I stand here full of power. Yes, the power to do anything. I am reborn in this moment. No longer do I question meaning. Oh my god, the Phantom! Stan, look out! Guys, I'm having a moment. What the hell? Ah! Stan, you okay? Well, we're going to starve to death. Can't you fly down? Yeah, poorly. I'd rather not have to. I'm okay. Great, please come get us. <laughs> Never mind, he's dead. <gasps> he's alive! See guys, invincible. Now to rebuild that staircase. He's dead. I can't watch! Oh boy, a couple of friends exploring. I wonder what we'll find next. A mesa? A beach? Oh boy, another grassy plain. Wait, where's Bam Bam? He's totally radical! This looks like another great place to build another crap house. Would be nice to build on the foundation we've built instead of just abandoning all our homes the day after we've built them. Nah. This place is great. There's lots of trees, and I saw a huge ravine down there with lava and water flowing into it. Stan was right. The ravine was big. But what was even bigger was the dark secret that had lived inside of it for decades. All right, let's build a house. Okay, one more block to go, and we're- Oh god, a bee! Relax, he's friendly! Really? What's he dropping? It's just pollen. Oh, okay. Yep, just spraying his seed all over your new living room. What? I'm gonna head out and start a small farm. We'll finally have a stable food source. <gasps> you guys, a white horse! There, there, buddy. Just gonna- <laughs> Relax, friend. Here's an apple. Okay, now let's... Well, now you're just being difficult. I know you're becoming a farmer now, and I wanted to give you a gift. Ooh, it's a diamond hoe. Thank you. How useful. I used the diamonds you were storing in the chest to make it. You don't say. All right, some wheat, some melons, and some sugar cane. Now, while these grow, I'm gonna go down and explore that dangerous ravine. Hey, bird butt, you wanna come down to the ravine and explore with us? No, I'll hang back and watch Bam Bam. Plus, I'm gonna listen to some old records. Ah, uh, the classics. Okay, so theoretically, I should just be able to jump straight down and just land in the water. Uh, I don't know, dude. Why don't you try to build down? Ugh, fine. Wow, there's a lot of caves in the side of these walls. Imagine, the entire land beneath our feet waiting to be explored. Careful, Stan. You're dangerously close to the edge, and it's a long way down. Ah! Stan! Uh. Oh, man, that really hurt. Wow, I'm shocked you survived that. Brush yourself off, and let's get out of here. Wait a second, I see a villager over there. That's funny, I didn't know villagers even lived in this part of the biome. Excuse me, Mr. Villager, would you happen to have any- Oh my god, he's some kind of zombie villager! Uh-oh, this might be it for us. Uh-oh, this might be the end. No way, man, we will survive this. Put on your iron helmet. No, dude, I look stupid in that thing. Put it on, Stanthony! <sighs> This looks so stupid. Maybe we can lure them up out of the shade. That way they'll burst in the flames. Or we can tell them there's a delicious chicken just on top of the cliffs. Apple trees, wheat, melons. I'd say we've got a pretty nice farm. You know, I'm gonna be honest, it's pretty boring watching you. Usually Stan's dumbass would have us deep in trouble right now. You, on the other hand, just kind of, uh, sit there. What the... Hey, you! Get away from there! Oh god, uh... Wow, maybe you're not so lame after all. 
No, dude. We don't need more useless crap taking up inventory space. Ugh, fine. Welp, Stan, if this is the end, there's something I've always wanted to tell you. You're kind of a Alright, I'm just gonna run and hide. Maybe under that waterfall, they won't be able to see me. Wait a minute, that's it! Stan, ascend up the waterfall! Blow it up! Ascend, my idiotic brethren! Oh god, what's going on? Trust the process, Staniel! Well, we're stuck down here forever, and now there's no point of even getting up there. The sun's going down. Well, that was a successful day. Wow, usually Stan and that stupid pig would be back by now. Missing a meal is not like them. Wait, where are you going? Careful on the edge there, do- What the- Hey, idiot! Help us, please! Of course, you're gone for half a day and about to become zombie food. Would you please just help us? I used all my cobblestone on that stupid statue of myself. Oh well, worth it. Wait, Chick, lower Bam Bam down, and the zombies will end up chasing him up there. We can cure the zombies with the apples on the farm! Hey, that's my farm! Get your own apples! Ugh, alright, fine. Good call on keeping that string, little dude. Great job! The villagers are chasing him! Alright, we're gonna head up there too. Hey, zombie folk! Y'all want some apples? Stan, the apples have to be golden if they're gonna cure the villagers. We're gonna have to smelt Stan's golden leggings down to make the apples golden. Ruin my golden slacks? Over my dead body? Hold them down! Ooh. These are delicious! Thanks for saving my family and I! You owe me a pair of golden pants, asshole. Those were designer. 24 carat! I've got 24 carats for you right here! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, we're really gonna end on that stupid joke? Way to go, idiots. We're officially lost at sea. Uh, I'm pretty sure we need to head that way. Wait, no, maybe that way. Okay, let's just stay calm and keep rowing. Land will generate eventually. Hey, look at that! It's some sort of ancient ocean monument! I bet that could be our next adventure! Let's go explore- Turn around now, or be cursed with eternal fatigue! Uh, let's just see what's over this way. Whoa, check it out! It's a coral reef! Look at all those delicious tropical fish! Last one in's an unborn chicken! I take offense to that. Let me just drink this water-breathing potion. Okay, I admit, these coral reefs are kinda pretty. Oh yeah? Why don't you marry them? <laughs> <laughs> I'll come back for you. Well howdy, land folk! Wow, you dolphin can talk? Yes sir, interesting fact. We dolphin are one of the smartest species on the planet. We can communicate without language, and even participate in recreational fornication. Thanks for that visual. Welcome to the Coral Reef, where we ocean mobs live in harmony and friendship. Wow, a peaceful coexistence. You know, I love to see that. You have a beautiful home here. But, um, is there anything else to do besides swim around and look at coral? Why, yes. There's an underwater ruin made of sandstone nearby. Follow us. Wow, an underwater ruin. Careful, there's a giant squid swimming around it. I'll handle this. While Stan brutally murders that squid, here's a fun fact for you. Did you know that in Minecraft there were over 2,700 different random combinations of tropical fish? Oh my god, you guys, it's a treasure map! Oh boy, time for a long and arduous quest across the entire biome to find it! Eh, let's just cut to that part now. Stan dug for the entire day that day even though the chest was only three blocks deep. In fact, the only reason it took so long was because he was using his axe instead of his shovel, like a dumbass. Hey, there it is. Uh, kinda looks just like a normal chest. No way, dude, it's a treasure chest. What's inside? A blue ball and a cake. Throw the ball, throw it! Now, uh, what should we do with the cake? I, I have an idea. What do you see up there? Hmm, I see a mountain with some dirt and some stone, another mountain with some dirt and some stone, and a mountain with some dirt and some stone. 
Ooh, sounds like we've got some options. Ugh, why did we spawn in the worst seed? Wait a second, I see a beach just off the north side. I'm beach bound, baby! Oh man, the beach life is a life for me. Just laying back, catching a tan. Well, to be fair, you really weren't doing much before, so... This is great! Free drinking water and all of our friends can swim. We can finally get rid of that dangerous pond that's damn built in front of the old place. <laughs> Yeah, that llama's gonna die in that pond. Oh my gosh, sea turtles! Hey, nice shell, bro! I'm a woman, you joik! Yeah, and you kids are ruining our honeymoon! Can't you see we're trying to get romantic? Ew, you sound like you're 80. We sea turtles live a long time! Now if you'll let me, I'd like to get back to trying to reproduce with my wife. Stop watching! All right, we should probably build a house or something. Ugh, building houses is boring. Here, play with this. Ooh, hey, fishy fishy. All right, good work, team. You did literally nothing to help. Didn't I, though? Didn't I? No. Now back outside to enjoy the beach. Dude, are you actually putting that fish inside of Mega Chest? Yeah, dude, I don't want anything to happen to it. No matter what kind of trouble we get into, this chest goes nowhere. It's great. <laughs> Sometimes I wish I could be free In a world I've so much yet to see But here is where I am best The life of a mega chest At night I lie awake and stare These walls have never felt so bare Someday I will be Holy sh! the chest is moving. Hey, look at that! The sea turtles must have given birth! Baby turtles! I'd like to take a plastic straw to them. Uh-oh, that one's having trouble making it to the shore! It's the sun, you morons. The turtles need hydration. He's not gonna make it! I've got just the thing. Careful, Stan. If you dump that bucket, the fish will fall on land and die! Sorry, little fella. You're going airborne. Now run to the ocean, my reptilian child! There, we saved the day. Jesus, I'm starving. Oh man, we haven't eaten all day. You two, rock, paper, scissors to see who we kill and eat. You can't kill me! I'm the only one who remembers the coordinates to get home! Damn it, he's right. I wish I hadn't dropped my map. Hey, maybe this guy knows where we can find some food. Oh my god, it's a stray! Well, it's been fun, you guys. Yeah, I can't lie to you. It actually hasn't. That's right, I forgot we had a tamed wolf. Thanks, Mr. Wolf. How can we ever repay you? Y'all got emeralds? Uh, yeah, but... Give me your emeralds. Hey, I'm a rich-ass wolf! Whoa, it's a frozen ocean! Thank you, we have eyes. Yes, but what we don't have is food. Wait a sec. Who wants a fresh cod? Oh boy, we're gonna have a feast tonight! And so, they realized that in order for all of them to play together, they were going to need to buy a realm. <gasps> but none of them had any money, so they were going to have to ask for their mom's credit card to cover the monthly fee. <gasps> and after they had finally built the ultimate fortress, they found out that one of their little brothers had accessed the world and griefed it! <laughs> That's it. I'm not sleeping the night. As a leader of our group, I too will stay up all night to keep watch of- <gasps> Good morning. Ew, we shared a sleeping bag? I was the big spoon. Hey, what happened to all the salmon? There was a big pile right here when we went to bed. Someone must have came along and stole it. Probably those red-eyed rabbits. Stupid albino zombies. Will you guys relax? I'm sure there's a totally normal, non-lethal explanation for this. Oh my god, polar bear! Ah! Save me before I become pork sausage! This is terrible. This whole situation has just snowballed into a giant mess. That's it! Snowball! Stan, throw that snow! Take that! 
Oh no! It just made him angrier! Pork chop, jump in the water! What? No, it's cold! And I can't swim! Trust me! Great job! Now let's get out of here! Take that, you endangered asshole! Man, how come we never explored the desert biome before? It's warm, it's got a nice breeze, and look at all these cactuses! Why don't you give it a nice hug? Hey, check it out! Rabbits! He takes the ball upfield, past the halfbacks, he shoots, he scores! Whoa, what's that? Some sort of desert temple. Should we go inside? Come on, you already know we're going in. Ooh, purple dirt! Mine, it's Stanthony! Jeez, that could have been painful. Hey, there's a bunch of chests down there. I'm gonna jump and land right on that stone trap looking thing. Wait, wait, I'll get us down there safely. Okay, rotten flesh, bones, and string. I'm noticing a pattern here. What, garbage? Oh my god, guys, guess what's in this one? Sand! If we wanted sand, we could have just mined this sand here. Uh-oh. Somebody in this temple wants us dead! I can't imagine. Well, the responsible thing to do is climb back up and not touch any of these explosives. Agreed! I'm allergic to bombs! Just gonna throw my flint all the way up out of the way so there's no chance it- Oh my god, it's gonna land on the bombs! Phew! That was close! Um, guys? Um, either that explosion killed me and I'm in heaven, or we just stumbled upon a gold mine. We're gonna be rich! Hey dude, there's those idiots who used you like a soccer ball. Looks like they found the crap ton of gold. Well, what can I do? We're just a passive mob. Not all of us. Hey, pork chop, throw another golden ore in the furnace for me, would ya? You got it. Boy, I'm so excited to make a bunch of golden carrots. Ore goes in, gold comes out. Ore goes in, gold comes out. Ore goes in. Ah, a killer bunny! <laughs> no, pork chop 2.0. No, please. What do you want? Please say gold. All I have is gold. Ah! Ow! Damn it! Ah! You must stop face while I run away. Ah! You, uh, you didn't set a respawn point, did you? Oh, huh, guess not. We lost all that gold? Hey, wait, you can't find the gold without the map? I'm going to jump off a cliff. Hey, get back here and get your fence. I have apples. Why do all these horses hate me? Everyone hates you. Come on, let's go find him. He couldn't have gone far. Ew, God, what is this water? It's a swamp. Oh boy, another biome we get to explore. Hey, let's climb to the top of that giant mushroom. We'll be able to find the horse from up there. Hey, not so fast, my guy. What the hell are you supposed to be? That looks like something I'd sneeze out of my nose. I'm a slime, and we rule this swamp, you hear me? A slime? That's right, tell him, slime. Yeah, that's right, we're the slime gang, the slimiest gang. Wait, so every slime is just named slime? Damn straight, except little slime X. Tell him. Yeah, that's right. Look, our horse ran somewhere over here. We just want to look for him, so... That horse belongs to Slime Gang now. Now beat it, or we'll turn you into a fossil, like we did to that guy. Hey, we're tough too. We're a gang all on our own. A brotherhood to the death. I hate both of these guys. Yeah? Well, if you're so tough, why don't you go explore that witch hunt? Then you can be in our gang. Uh, sure, we can do that. Okay, I know I talked a really big game back there, but I'm worried. If there's a witch in there, we could get killed. Really? Ooh, it's rustic in here. Yeah, let's just be happy there's no witch. Oh, wow, a black cat. And he brought us a gift. It's a lucky rabbit's foot. <coughs> oh, wait, it's a raw chicken hide. Well, we got lunch. That's disgusting. All right, there's not really much to do in here, so let's just... Oh, God, a witch. Throat punch. <laughs> Uh, this swamp water is hard to run in. Let's build up to that mushroom. We'll be safe up there. Aha! Uh -huh. Good luck killing us now, witch. You'll never reach us all the way up. Ah, damn it, that's a glass bottle. Oh, no! The witch cursed you with slowness. He was pretty slow to begin with. Well, guys, safe to say we're screwed. I bet those slimes will be watching us and laughing while we die. Oh, 
Actually, I killed them. Hey, there's our horse. If you have their slime balls, we can make a trampoline and bounce to it safely. But I don't know how to make slime blocks. Dude, this is bedrock. Just make the damn blocks. We're out of here. Now back to the farm. <laughs> I mean, uh, not the farm. Apple Orchard, please come back. Sir, perhaps you've heard the news. We were visited by a noble Steve last night. A Steve? Yes, you know, Steve, the one whom the world revolves around. Slayer of evil mobs and dragons. My god, and he's here with us now? He's inside this igloo house sleeping. Sleeping? Why, it's almost noon. <sighs> Morning, assholes. Hey, what's for breakfast? Well, we hadn't prepared anything. What about him? Uh, sir, that is my son. Look at the size of that head. That thing could feed a whole village. All right, onwards. So, we were wondering, since we have you here in our snow village, we've heard brave stories of you traversing the biome, fighting off mobs, we've watched on Twitch streams, and Dan TDM videos. Yeah, so what's your question? We need your help. Skeleton strays have been surrounding the village each night, preparing to strike. We believe that tonight, they're going to try and kill our village cartographer. I'm in the process of mapping out a new world for us. One that isn't cold and miserable and covered in snow. We ask your help in fighting off the strays. We know you have a deep history of combat. <laughs> Might as well start crafting shovels to dig your graves now. Where the hell have you guys been? We were trying to mine some ice blocks. No such luck. So please, sir, just even for one night, help us protect our village. What's in it for me, huh? We'll give you three carrots. We'll do it! All right, we need to keep our eyes peeled for these strays. Unfortunately, since we lost all our stuff, all I've got is this wooden sword. Seems like you've got this under control. I'm gonna go find an igloo with a single torch in it to stay warm. Hey, psst, friend, I want to thank you for being our defender, our chicken tender defender. Uh, sure, you're in, uh, good hands. I feel safer than ever with those brave adventurers. I don't know. The human is a complete jackass. I would honestly rather have just been killed by these strays than spend the whole day with him. That, uh, that must be our friends. Who is it? Oh, sh**. Do we have anything in here that will save us from strays? Yes, I have my maps. How the hell are maps gonna stop a zombie skeleton? Live by the map, die by the map. Oh, God. Damn you, strays! Oh god, the strays are here. Uh, here. He's dying. Maybe we can save the map? It's no use. It's covered in snow. Well, the good news is that these episodes always end in some sort of joke to lighten the mood. Man, can you believe Stan is making us throw all of our stuff away? It's about not being wasteful. We've got too much stuff we don't need or use. Goodbye, Lapis. Oh, god damn it. Goodbye, books. Hey, I wanted to keep those. You've never opened any of those books. Do you even know what they're used for? Uh, building bookshelves? Anyway, lunch is ready, so take a seat. Ew, what the hell is this? Mushroom stew. Give it a chance, it's healthy. If I was concerned with going green, I'd lick the moss off that cobblestone outside. Hmm, you know, it's actually not that bad. I feel like I can take on the world. Oh, oh god, my stomach! Ugh. What did you put in that stew? Not just some red mushrooms, some brown mushrooms, and some wither rose. Wither rose? Well, he's contracted the swine flu. <laughs> that wither rose is gonna turn my heart black! Okay, uh, let's go out and explore. We're bound to find the flower that'll cure him in the forest. Hello? Any oxeye daisies out here? Hey, that fox probably knows this forest like the back of his paw. Excuse me, Mr. Fox. A uh, little help? Hey, get, get out of here! Well, that fox really had it out for me. Yeah, gives me an idea. Aha! And now we wait. What the hell? That ugly piece of crap looks nothing like me. <laughs> what the? Gotcha! Now tell us where we can find some healing flowers. Never! I will escape! Okay, come to my cave. Your friend is withering away. All he needs is a healing potion to combat the decay. Wow, so you're like some sort of magic fox, huh? Heh, <laughs> hardly. 
I just like potions and enchantments and stuff. I remember when I had books, until my quote-unquote friends threw them into the lava. Here, take this one. It'll let you enchant your armor and your tools. <gasps> a book of enchantment! You're really giving this idiot a lot of power. Take a swig, Mr. Pig. I'm going to create an enchantment table, and soon I will have the sharpest of swords, the strongest of armor, and the most, uh, fish-like lungs to breathe underwater or whatever. Yes! Finally, we won't be noobs anymore! We'll be all-powerful gods! We will rule the biome, and we will live forever! <laughs> we finally did it! A house we can stay in. 33rd time's the charm, huh? We're surrounded by water on three sides, a nether portal with a lava pit, and a small farm out front. Will you hurry up and get us out of here? He wants us to breed! I'm trying, Gerald! Can't you see that I'm trying? Um, maybe we should just let that cow free. Another cow is bound to wander over here someday. Now let's just enjoy that beautiful sunset. Now, time to continue the mission. Let me guess. You're armoring up to traverse the biome, throwing eggs at innocent sheep. You brave, brave warrior. I'm trying to make ender pearls, okay? Which means we need to stay up all night and hunt endermen. Now come on. Hey, at least it's a nice night. Of course. Okay, there's got to be an enderman around here somewhere. Let's split up. I'll check along the shore. Chick, you hit the forest on that hill, and Porkchop, you go search in those big shafts we dug out. All right, I love big shafts. I bet you do. Okay, Enderman, let's make this easier on both of us. If you're out there, just stay hiding. I don't feel like gouging the eyeballs out of a hostile teleporting mob. In fact, I'm not even gonna look. Just gazing straight up into space, can't find anything. Oh, f I'm gonna take this just in case. Whoa, okay. Kinda hard to see with this pumpkin on my head. One step, two step, three step, four. Hello? I'm looking for a Mr. Man. First name Ender? I can't really see, but I'm sure there's none down here. It's gonna be tough getting back up. The rain made my feet all slippery. Oh God! Oh man, this is taking longer than I thought. <sighs> Maybe I'll just sit down for a sec. Hey you, put that block down and get ready to die. Oh, uh, yeah, I love what you've done with the place. I just thought maybe this block would look better over there. Get back here. Aha, uh -huh, an ender pearl. You guys, we did it. Uh, that's great. Yeah, I killed like 12, but none of them dropped anything. All right, I saw Porkchop come down here with a jack-o'-lantern helmet. Um, dude? Oh, God. I'm sorry, man. Uh, hold on. Say hello to Porkchop 2.0. It's not the same. This pig doesn't- What's up, guys? Thanks for letting me out of that pen. Now we can go on infinite adventures. Yeah, okay, this'll do. Come on, guys. The Ender Pearl is telling us to head this way. Uh, how much farther's this stronghold? It's not my fault I have chicken legs. Only the Eye of Ender knows. That's the beauty of it. Now toss that pearl, Stan. Well, we thank him for his sacrifice. Don't worry. I've got another one. Yeah. Let's follow it. Oh my god, you guys! A pink sheep! They say there's only a 0.08417332656% chance you'll ever find one! Oh man, the eye got stuck in that tree! Well, let's toss something up there to knock it down! Ugh, fine. Daddy? Son? Gotcha! Oh man, no meat? Behind us! We've gotta be close! 
All right, the stronghold should be somewhere under this mountain. Let's just dig straight down. Uh, isn't that like rule number one of what not to do? Ah, <sighs> great. I'll just head back to the spawn point now. I'll see you after you die. Aha! A brick of mossy stone. You know what that means. A tree and a rock made sweet, sweet love? Just beyond this block is a hidden underground fortress with a portal to a magical realm. <laughs> oh god, a silverfish! All right, that wasn't too difficult. Let's explore. Whoa, a zombie cell. <sighs> hey, zombie, uh, where's the end portal? Brains. You're gonna be quite disappointed. Yeah. No hugs for you, zombie man! Now onward to more exciting, death-defying adventure! Oh, a library? I wanted to kill things. Come on, we can still kill these spider webs. In there! It looks like there's an end portal! Wow, the end portal. I'm so excited! Ah! I too cannot wait for the end. Ah! Pork chop, will you kill these stupid bugs, please? Die, tiny bugs! You go squish now! All right, once I plug this final eye into the portal, we're on our way to defeat the dragon. Uh-oh. Oh my god.